Blog Talk Radio. If it's Friday, then it must be time for the one and only 30 JK. Right here, right now, on Blog Talk Radio. I'm your studio announcer, Bumper Morgan. And now, and now your host, Jason Kelly. That's right. Sure. Come on. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go. Well, hello there. It's 30 JK on Blog Talk Radio, and of course, my name is Jason Kelly. Four o'clock in the PM on a Friday afternoon. Rocking and rolling and non stopping and hip hopping and all the good shit. Yeah, baby. <laughs> Jason Kelly. Uh huh. All right. Let's kill the beat. Okay. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we have with us today a very good friend of mine, all the way from my hometown in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. And this guy is everywhere online, man. He even had a spot with 106 in Park. Yes, that 106 in Park. And responsible for this. Listen. Oh my God! Can you believe it? All right. Just a little something, something to get you started, ladies and gentlemen. With me right now, rapper, actor, and activist, ready to drop it on you like it's hot, Mr. Michael Hagler III, a.k.a. the one and only Big Mike on 30JK right now. Yeah. (laughs) And I see the phone lines are already lit up, 347-857-2310. A blog dot radio dot com forward slash JKFX for life. That's JKFX the number four L I F E all capital all one words for the word and you know that word. Big Mike, how you doing, sir? Man, what's going on, Jason Kelly? Man, what's good? Yes, yes, yes. I just played a little sample of get it cracking, get it cracking, get it cracking, get it cracking. Now, before we get on to the audience here, I want some background on you. Okay, okay, that's cool. So tell us and the rest of 30 JK Nation where you're from and how you got to be where you are today. Man, what's going on, everybody, man? It's your boy Big Mike. It's Big Mike Tom. Um, I want to thank Jason Kelly for having me on this show. But to answer your question, man, social media is how I got to where I'm at today. All social media, you know what I'm talking about? Um, just Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, just promoting, promoting, promoting. If it wasn't for internet, if it wasn't from social media sites, I wouldn't be where I'm at today. Man, and you and and you even got yourself a spot on 106 in Park. Now tell me how that how that got started. Well, uh, pretty much how I uh, came to play. You know, I seen 106 in Park looking for a new host. So uh, me and my homegirl Kennedy, 
we hopped on it. We made our audition tape, and we just started promoting, and it, it went viral, man. A lot of people uh, pretty much seen the video, and a lot of people was hoping that we, you know, had that spot on one of us in park, but we, we didn't get the spot, man, but we got a lot of exposure for it, for doing that. You know what I'm saying? So it was a good experience. Mm-hmm. If at first you don't succeed, try and try again, and now look at you. Right, right, right. You got Let's Get It Cracking going viral, and everybody's going nuts right now. 414 numbers all day up in here. We start Man, with the 414-807 number here, and it's Jason Kelly on 30JK on the air, and so are you. Who am I speaking to, please? You're on the air? Can you hear me? Call back. I can't hear you. Okay. Let's try another one. Four one four nine four nine number. Jason Kelly on thirty JK, you're on the air and so are you. Who am I speaking with, please? Hello, you're on the air with Jason. Nobody, there's nobody there. Hello. Sound like nobody, nobody ain't saying nothing, huh, Jason Kelly? <laughs> mm. They're just listening in, I, I think. And hey, call back, That's you guys. Up. I want to hear from you. All right. Now, um, I got something to say about um, that one video that I saw just recently about um, um, that uh, team stop the violence video where you and Guala bands. We're in that video, you know. Right. You know, you getting jacked. You know, saying, you know, you know, give me all your money, give me all your money. Yeah, you, you big Mike from all from all that social media and stuff, man, and all that and all that. Tell me how that right, came right. to be. Man, it's just you know, I just I just pay attention to the news, man. And the reason why I did that video because it's a lot of armed robberies going on it worldwide. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, I do YouTube, I do the skits, and I just wanted to put out a positive message. So I uh, teamed up with Guala, and um, we just made it happen, man. With the video, I just wanted to show how real it can be, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's, it's entertaining, but at the end of the day, it's still giving out a positive message, you know what I'm saying? If, if everybody listening right now, go on YouTube, search uh, Big Mike, it's Big Mike Tom, Arm Robbery, to uh, see the skit. And it's just pretty much showing how I got killed, you know what I'm saying, for two dollars and some Adidas, and now he in jail for the rest of his life. And real talk, man, all around the world, man, people be doing dumb, dumb stuff, you know what I'm saying, killing people for nonsense, you know what I'm saying, over crazy stuff, and it shouldn't happen at all, you know what I'm saying. So I just wanted to, you know, make that video to show, you know what I'm saying, it's real out here. Team stop the yeah. violence. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now. Team Stop the Violence. When did you first start that group? Uh, I started that group back in um, 2011 when uh, my uncle got killed. My grandma, she uh, pretty much motivated me to start that because uh, my uncle was killed by a police uh, officer in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. So my grandma knew I was throwing all type of events and stuff like that in the city, and I had a big, you know, team fan crowd. So my grandma wanted me to do something about it to get the people's attention. So I created Team Stop the Violence, and um, I did all I can to pretty much get the word out for my uncle's death, and we was out here rallying, um, just doing all different types of things in the city to get, you know, the right people attention. So that's how Team Stop the Violence got started, because my uncle got killed by a police officer. Oh, wow. That, that, is, that is really hurtful right there. Now, yeah. you know, for those of you that don't live in Milwaukee, where where is where where is your studio located? You said where is what? Where is your studio located? Oh uh, well, right now you know what I'm saying I'm, I'm uh, working with my homeboy Doc Holiday and also my uh, pops Cool Water Beats. You know what I'm saying? Uh, right now I'm not sure if the exact location because I know that was moving uh, moving studios. But if you're on Facebook and you're in Milwaukee, Wisconsin, and you're looking for some producers, hit up uh, Doc Holiday and also hit up Cool Water Beats. All you gotta do is search Doc Holiday on uh, on Facebook and also search Cool Water Beats on Facebook and. I guarantee you they're going to get you all right. 
Oh, awesome, awesome. How long have you been writing raps and doing doing your thing and producing and all that kind of stuff? Well, people don't really know this, but I've been writing rap since I was, like, 15, 14 years old. Um, I was doing, like, different PSAs for my school, Benson High School in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. You know, uh, you know, just doing different things for the school. Um, I just started back, you know, doing the rap thing as a project, you know what I'm saying, because of my YouTube fan base with over 3 million views worldwide. I just wanted to see where it go, and I'm on a... Uh, I'm on a radio interview with you, so it's, you know, it's doing real good, man. <laughs> I'm getting a lot of people attention worldwide, so it's doing real good. But uh, people don't notice me. Let's get it cracking was one of, like, one of the first songs I wrote, like back when I was like 15 years old. So uh, really? I decided to put it out. Yeah, I decided to put it out uh, this year because I had a dream about it, man. I feel like God was giving me some type of vision or something. So I uh, hit up my guy, Doc Holiday, and I hit up my pops who made the beat, Cool Water Beats, Track Things. Yeah, uh, he re- he redid the beat, and um, I hit up Doc Holiday, got it uh, mixed and mastered, radio already, and a week later, uh, it was on the radio. Cool, cool. Hey, listen, if you wanna if you wanna be if you wanna be on the radio and you wanna and you wanna call us, please turn turn down the volume on your phone or whatever, you know, so that we can hear you. We're gonna try again with these two numbers here: eight zero seven four one four area code. Um, this is Thody JK. You're on the air with Big Mike. What's up, Big Mike? Hey, what's going on, man? Man, I just zoned in, tuned in, see what, see what's up. Man, that's what's up, man. You know, I for real. You, you know, I might not show it, but you know, I, I um, I be looking into everything you do. Man, that's love, man. For real, for real, man. I I, I definitely really appreciate it from the from the bottom of my heart. Mm-hmm. Yeah, for yeah. for love, you know. For sure, Gotta man. show Make support. Sure. For sure, man. That's that's love, man. Make sure uh, you write me on Facebook, man. I got something for you, man. Just to even calling in, you know what I'm saying? Like showing that you support everything that's going on, man. I I really do appreciate that because it's, it's kind of hard to find support in your hometown, you know what I'm saying? So I I really appreciate it. Uh, hey, um, you got a question for Big Mike while I have you on? Um, no, all I really want to say is that just keep your head up, bro. You Man, for saying? sure. The haters ain't about nothing. You know, you got a lot of love in Milwaukee, and we like to see you doing good. Man, for sure. Yeah. Man, I really appreciate it. And we appreciate Team Stop the Violence. You know, you need to get that back up and going because there's a lot of crazy stuff going on in Milwaukee. Right, right, definitely, man. I, I I really appreciate it. Make sure you write me on Facebook, man, for real. All right, bro. For sure, for sure. All right, thank you for calling. Okay. You're welcome. All right, thank you. Okay, now let's get to let's not, let's get back to that um other four one four number four one four nine four nine number right here on thirty J K. Jason Kelly on the air, and so are you. Who am I speaking to, please? Hello, you're on the air. This is Jason Kelly. Hello? Hello? All right, call back 949. Okay, back to you, my... And... For those of you that don't know, I used to co-host on um, on on this radio show called the Saturday Afternoon Boogie Bang, and and that was with Barry Johnson, Craig McNeil, and um, all uh, thousands thousands of characters. Man, ninety-one point seven WMSC. Much love to Tom Crawford. Hey, hey. Mm-hmm. And, uh-oh, I think we see that uh, 807 number again. Let me see who this is again. Jason Kelly on 30JK, who am I speaking with, please? No, I was just um, calling back because I wanted to still hear the radio show, but it hung me up after I talked to y'all. Oh, oh, okay. You still want to listen to it? Okay. Yeah. Well, thanks Thanks for uh Thanks for calling in, okay? okay? All right. 
Okay, like I just said, um, for those of you that don't know me, I used to um, volunteer at uh, WSA, hold it down every, almost every Saturday with uh, Craig McNeil, Barry Johnson, and the Saturday Afternoon Boogie Bang. Now, I've heard of you because of the fact that you were in the Milwaukee Journal Sentinel. That's where I know you from. I I had read about you, and you were you were definitely you were definitely putting it down when it came to um, doing positive things. Right. And the fact that um, you're blowing up now as you are, man, you really deserve to be commended, Mike. Man, I really appreciate it, man. For real, like this. I just don't know how much this means to me, man, for real. Any, anybody you want to give a shout-out to while you're, while you're still on the air? Uh, like, definitely, man. I want to give a shout-out to my mama. Mama, I love you. Uh, <laughs> my dad, you know what I'm saying? Cool out of beats. You know what I'm saying? Everybody that's coming on my status, man. Right now I'm actually on the phone, so I can't look at my phone. You know what I'm saying? To, to personally shout people out, so... You know, so I want to thank everybody who you know who commented my status for a shout out. Shout out to y'all, man, for real, for real. Uh, shout out to Justin Kelly, uh, Daddy JK, man. Shout out to DJ Craig McNeil. Shout out to Too Much Talent uh, for shooting my official uh, music video. Um, who else? Shout out to D Rock for being in the video. Shout out to B100 GA for playing my song on B100.7. Shout out to Living Mass on 103.7. Hit me up. Ask for my phone. Man, shout out to everybody that's helping the Let's Get It Cracking movement go far, man. I really appreciate y'all because we're getting it cracking 2015. For real, for real. Oh, my gosh. just You just won't believe it. Now, now when I hear the name Big Mike, usually when I hear the name Big Mike, I usually, I usually think of the Ghetto Boys from Houston, Texas. That's why right. I hear that name. And everybody does everybody everybody never knew that there was a big mic in Milwaukee until um let's get it cracking came along. Right, definitely, definitely, man, definitely. I I think people knew the big Milwaukee, but I think a lot of people didn't know like Big Mike rap. Like, you know what I'm saying? I had some people who went to high school uh, with me and stuff like that who knew what I do and who grew up in the hood with me and everything. But I think a lot of people were shocked that I actually make music because the people used to meet with teen and South of Violence and people used to meet, you know what I'm saying, throwing different type of big events in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. So when I came out with this project and it's blowing up the way it is, over 11,000 views since last night, man, I think a lot of people like shocked, like, dang, this boy Big Mike rap and he's getting all these views and he's on the V100.7. It's like shocking to a lot of people. And don't forget Kiss FM. Kiss, uh, Kiss FM and also uh, 30 JK, man. I really appreciate it. Yep, yep. You know it. You know it. You know. I promised you a spot on my show, and now here you are. Oh, yeah, man. I appreciate it, man. For real. Yes, Ooh, 937. 937 is calling, and let's see who this is right now. Jason Kelly on 30 JK on the air, and so are you. <laughs> Oh, they dropped on me. Yikes. Woo. Man. They, probably, they nervous, man. They, they, man, they dropped on me. <laughs> Call back 937. Jason Kelly with Big Mike. Let's see the cracking. Hey, let's get it cracking. Juke, your boy. Juke, juke, your boy. Come and juke, your boy. Juke, juke, your boy. Even I, even I am singing this song. It's so catchy. <laughs> Man, that's what's up, man. For how real. Do you, how do you, how do you come up with all this catchy stuff, man? I mean, it's man. like it's like viral, man. Once it's out, it's out there. Man, I, man, I, I was little, man. I can't. I just went to my uh, pop school while the beast was like, man, I wanna. I think if I can remember correctly, I think I was in high school and, uh, and I was in drumline. We used to be like, let's get it cracking, hey, let's get it cracking, just to get like you know get stuff hype when we bored. So I'm going to make a song about that, you know what I'm saying? So I went to my producer, Cool Water Beats, which is my pops, and he made the beat, and we just took off from there. You know what I'm saying? 
And it's just, it's funny that you said you, that you, you know what I'm saying, you listen to the song and it's stuck on you because on Vine, man, like I'm on Vine now and so many people around the world are making like different videos off my song. It's a lot of older people, Asian people, African people, you know what I'm saying, black, white, like everybody just showing love, like, you know what I'm saying? Everybody. Yeah, from young to old, you know what I'm saying, making their own video. And let's get it cracking or doing something silly off the uh, off the uh, song or something. Show up some type of love, some type of support. Like it's it's just, it's just a blessing, man. I thank God for everything. Oh man, hey, listen, I want to know this. Where did you film that vid? Where did you film that music video officially? Well, I'm working with God at this school called uh, Last of Wednesday, I believe it's called. It's uh it's out next to it, the Boys and Girls Club. On Ninth and Rain, we shot it there. Um, the lady was kind enough to let us uh, come shoot the video there. And she also, also let us shoot it two times. So it was just two shoots I had. You know what I'm saying? Like, it wasn't just one shoot. It was two shoots. And I promoted it online. You know what I'm saying? So it was a 50% chance that people would show up. A 50% chance people won't show up. And it turned out real good. I mean, everybody showed up for two full shoots. And it was we, we got it cracking, man. We made it happen. And now we had 11,000 views. And who and who played and who played the guy with the ruler, man? Well, that's D. Rock. He's, uh, he's a famous comedian uh, in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. He's he's very funny. Somebody I looked up to since I was little. You know what I'm saying? Uh, he's great at what he's doing. And, I, and when I make this video, I want to work with people I worked with before, or you know what I'm saying, people I uh, looked up to. And I'm glad that he was a part of it. And he's just a he just a, he's he's a real life comedian, man. He's he's very funny and very talented. Oh man, and, and at the end of that video, it's like it was cracking while it lasted, and then and then and then you got your butt kicked almost. <laughs> man, man. trying to still like you know what I'm saying, make it fun and get it cracking, but I still wanted to have type of message, man. You know what I'm saying? If you gonna act up in school, hopefully you gonna get a whip of how old you, no matter how old you. <laughs> oh my God, I, what? I, I don't want it to be. I can get it cracking, having fun. I want to, you know what I'm saying, show like, man, you can see, uh, hey, no matter how old you is, high school, now you're going to get your butt whooped. <laughs> oh man, it's, it's like it's like it's like the end of the of that movie House Party where the kid sneaks him, sneaks up in the bed, right? And then and then and then and then before you know it, oh, there go pops right there with the right. right hand. Snap. Your ass is yep. mine. Yep. No matter how old you are, you still got a whip. <laughs> I didn't work. Ow, ow! I didn't work too damn long to let you follow me. <laughs> like you got your damn mind, you know? Right. <laughs> all, 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 all night. For real. Right. For real. <laughs> For real, man. Oh, man. Three four seven eight five seven two three one zero. We got about seven minutes left in this interview. Big Mike, man, you are the man. Everybody wants you. Everybody's listening to you. Everybody's hearing you. How do they Man. get involved with? How do, how do they? Wow. I'm almost really out of questions here. I mean, I'm here talking to one of my favorite people from the Bruce City. Oh yeah, I'm telling you, it's party time up in here. Uh, nine four nine area nine four nine four one four. Let's see. If we can get them on right now, Jason Kelly on okay. Cody JK, you're Hello? on the air. Hello? Yes, you're on the air. Okay, sorry about last time. That was me the last time. I didn't know that I was getting caught or, like, you know, caught in or whatever. But, Big Mike, you know, I mean, it's so much love here in Milwaukee for you. I just want to say congratulations on all the successes you've had thus far. And I wish nothing but the best for you. I mean, You've done so much with the youth in the city, and I just want to see you do so much more as you grow into your career and have multiple of successes in your life. And you're awesome. So congratulations. Uh, thank <laughs> you so much. Uh, yeah, thank you so much, man. Like I said before to the last caller, man, I really appreciate you taking the time to even, you know what I'm saying, chime into the radio station to listen, to even get feedback, you know be nervous to do that, but, man, so many kind of words you just said, and I really, really appreciate it, like, from the bottom of my heart, and trust me, I'm I'm going to get on it, I'm going to do a lot to, you know what I'm saying, put on for the city, and I'm going to look out for everybody, like, 
for real, for real. Like, my whole goal at the end of all this to be able to start the Vibe Community Center, you know what I'm saying? To take revenue to be able to do stuff like that. So, you know what I'm saying? I want to get justice yeah. for my little brother who was killed by, uh, who was killed due to gun violence. I want to get justice for, you know what I'm saying, my uncle who was killed by police officers. Like, it's a reason why I do everything, and some people understand it, some people don't. But from the bottom of my heart, I really appreciate you calling in. No problem, no problem. Good luck, Big Mike. And, you know, seriously, I just, I mean, whenever you're really ready to, like, you know, do some groundwork with the youth activism, I'm here. <laughs> and I'm ready to get started with making some real change in the community. I mean, I think that's the most important thing ever. So, yeah, I'm, I'm glad to see that you're still trying to do that. And, you know, best of luck. For sure, man. Just, um, just please, please just write me on my Facebook right away because I definitely want to do that with you. No problem, no problem. I'm the one who just shared like a thousand times that you're on the radio, so you'll, <laughs> you'll really? know who okay. it is. <laughs> man, really, I'm a, I, trust me, I'm going to show love to everybody who, 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 who comment on the status, who share. It's just right now I'm actually on the phone talking, so I can't even look to see who's, you know. Yeah, no, no problem. No, 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 no. Good luck, though. You guys have okay. a nice day. Man, thank you so much. No problem. Thank you for calling, okay? Come back soon. All right. Man, Mike, 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 what? Mike, let me tell you something, man. You have been a blast to talk to, man, and we need to get together. When you come into Texas, dude, Man, hopefully, hopefully I come to Texas soon, man. You know, my son was born in Texas, and last time I was there, I didn't want to leave. I was crying like a baby. It's so fun in Texas. Oh, I, met right. some... <laughs> I met some cool, nice people. It was just nice to be out there. Why did you leave? <laughs> Why did you leave? You know, I still I still work in Milwaukee, you know what I'm saying? I got my house out in Milwaukee. You know, I was actually going there to be a part of my son's birthday. I was back in like two thousand twelve. You know what I'm saying? But man, it was it was an amazing experience. That's the first place I've actually been to in a long time. Uh since I was little leaving out of town from Milwaukee. So man, I had a I had a ball in Texas. I met some cool people, man. Well listen, Mike, it is a pleasure. A privilege and honor to have spoken to you, man. I hope to hear from you real soon, okay? For sure, man, for sure. And uh, also, too, man, just uh, send me this, send me, you know what I'm saying, the files for this, man, too, so I can share this for the people who didn't get to listen. And I appreciate you, man, for having me on your show from the bottom of my heart. All right, man. Hey, love you, man. Keep it up. Keep up the great work, all right? Man, for sure. For sure. Let's get you cracking, man, worldwide. Hey, let's get it cracking. Let's get it cracking. Hey, let's get it cracking. <laughs> for sure, man. Thanks a lot. All right. Bye-bye. All right. That's it for 30JK today. Man, thank you again to Big Mike, Michael Hagler the third. Check out Big Mike on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, and all the others. Because he's everywhere, just like yours truly is everywhere with Twitter, blog talk, and Facebook, and all that good stuff, man. Horns up ahead, I keep your channel, because that's what Truly Devils always do. Hey, I'll see you next time for another edition of 30JK. Till then, this is Jason Kelly saying... Peace out, much love, and remember, it's a J.K. thing, sissy. We gone. Party boy, you jack it. I don't say I run it, but I do keep it cracking. B.I.G. and my K.E. That boy be swagging. Party hit the ground, hoodie bossing, I'm grabbing. Let's get it cracking. Yeah, I'm on the flow, flow. I got money. I know you want more. I like the way she moves. I like the way she goes. Go. Now drop it, give me 50 like that boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah.
Hey, thanks for tuning in. This has been a JK Epics for Life online presentation for the David 3000 Network. Peace. Don't forget to subscribe to the Demon Thousand Network for great more content like this one.